what's up you guys it's sienna and today i have another crumble cookies food review for you today we have blue monster featuring chips ahoy salted caramel cheesecake apple crumb cake and french toast so let's get tasting All right, so the first one we're gonna do today is the Blue Monster, which is a Chips Ahoy cookie, which I'm guessing is based off the Cookie Monster. The icing is light blue, and let's give them a taste. It's a nice chocolate chip cookie that's kind of doughy still and delicious. The icing is light um, and good, and then there's a chunk of Chips Ahoy, tastes exactly like Chips Ahoy. I can't pinpoint exactly what type of icing that is, but it's like very light. It's not overly like buttercream or um, like some of the other icings. It's a very light icing. Um, this one is really good, um, but I'm gonna give it a seven and a half out of 10. Next I'm going to do French toast, which I poured a little dribble of syrup on. This one is a rectangle square cookie. Um, so let's give it a taste. This one's base is light, fluffy, more cakey, I would say. Um, and it has a light dusting of powdered sugar, the syrup, and the buttercream dollop on top. Uh, it tastes, it definitely simulates the taste of like French toast. Um, I'm more of a fan of thinner French toast, so the thicker one is more, I guess what some people do like with the French toast, but I like the at home like thin, breaded French toast. It definitely does not feel like a cookie to me. So while it's really good, I'm gonna rate it a little lower because it doesn't really feel like a cookie necessarily. So I'm gonna give it a four and a half out of 10. It's still really good and it does taste like French toast. It just feels weird because it's not really a cookie, you know? Next, we're gonna do the apple crumb cookie which looks very, very yummy. This one is really well done. Uh, the base cookie maybe has like a slight cinnamon in it and then it has a light icing. Then it has like coffee cake crumbs and chunks of apple on top of it. And it is really good. I really like that one. Yeah, I like that one a lot. I'm gonna give that an eight and a half out of 10. That is really good. Next and final cookie of the day is the salted caramel cheesecake. If you like caramel, you're gonna love this one. Uh, this one has a really nice caramel on it. Like, I don't know how to explain that. It's like nice and creamy, It's it's not like, I've had some bad caramels in the past for like caramel candies, but this one is a good one. Uh, this one has a nice sea salt flaking on it. The cheesecake part isn't overly cheesecakey, if that makes sense. Um, I don't like my cheesecake tasting too much like cheesecake. I like the addition of other flavors to complement it. And the base cookie is pretty just a basic cookie. It's more of a topping delivery device. Um, it's really good. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment below which flavor is your favorite this week. And make sure you subscribe. I post new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.